What is going on guys, Sir Lewis here, and in today's video, I'm gonna give you guys here a update on the wealth transfer, and if there's any new updates regarding the wealth transfer and all the prophecies that we heard. So before I start, I wanna say that our Telegram here, um, I had to go private the last couple of days, but now it will be public. So talking about the wealth transfer, I feel like ever since the beginning of the new year, it was just like a shock. Like so many people was just like, oh yeah, this is not going to happen. There's so many false prophets and there were so many people hating, especially in my group too. Certain people that came on and just cursing and saying a bunch of bad things. And, and I was shocked because, you know, just because the year ended doesn't mean that, you know, the wealth transfer will not happen. But I think the main reason why many people reacted that way was because there was many prophets that you know gave dated prophecies before 2022 ending they said certain things would happen and for those prophets yeah they were completely wrong and to be honest i really didn't share any of those big prophets that had those you know dated prophecies out of all of them i think i shared one of them that tc also talked about and you guys can go check out tc's videos because he did break down a lot of those prophets picking from their old videos and comparing to right now which i think is great because what happens is a lot of people watch old videos and like okay okay and then they forget about the prophecies that never came to pass. And then if there is one prophecy that came to pass out of like the, the 50, right? They'll probably make a prophecy fulfilled video and then they'll be like, oh, wow, look, this guy was right. But meanwhile, like all his other prophecies didn't come to pass, right? So but shout out to TC for, you know, making those videos. Go watch if you guys still haven't yet. And right now, as we speak, we did have an amazing pump here, right? When we were around 16,000 just a couple weeks ago, back in December, right? We had a huge big pump here to around 24,000, which we are right now. And ever since we started pumping this much, it reminded me of the prophecy from love is god and i think a couple other ones god's algorithm and there was a couple other people that were talking about a manufactured spike and basically what they said in the prophecy was that bitcoin was going to have one last major move and pump up they don't know the exact targets it could be 30k 40k but they said that it was going to be very unnatural in the way that it came to a point where it just stopped and then just came back crashing down to 20k 10k and then that's when the flash crash happened if you guys want to check out those videos you can check out love is god's channel also god's algorithm i think tc also shared them so we might be experiencing that right now with bitcoin as we are getting this really good bounce here from 16,000. right now regarding luna classic i do want to share uh christopher Harris's latest stream and he just had the stream here regarding luna classic and it connects with his previous stream which i also shared here a couple months back where he talked about binance coming out of nowhere and basically surprising everyone with luna classic by basically improving some type of burn for luna classic for them to improve their burns and make it faster and efficient for luna classic to burn more of their coins but let me read you guys here his latest stream that connects with that and it says right here in a dream i heard about the a price explosion i knew it was about crypto i was thinking of bitcoin and luna classic later in the dream i heard 0.2 percent after eight percent now i believe this relates to binance's plan for luna classic in my dream from 27 9 2022 linked here so he gives the link here to his previous stream that he gave on that day regarding the luna classic and binance's plan the plan from binance which caused luna classic price to take off and hit 10 cents i heard one of the celebrating people say 8.5 percent this is very similar to the eight percent i heard today my thoughts on what this could be is a binance putting up to 1 billion to buy and burn luna classic with that amount of money they could burn eight percent of the supply which is 549 billion luna classic even as the price rose such a huge burn and announcement and the act of buying so much luna classic to burn could be what causes the price to immediately 10x to above 0.001 which i saw in this stream now these are my thoughts and the lord has not confirmed what the eight percent is yet after this was the 0.2 percent which is the current on-chain burn tax finance only burns 0.1 percent of their fees so if they implemented a burn of 0.2 percent it would be at least double the burns from binance i don't think that's the end of binance's changes and based on previous streams we may see a higher burn tax later for faster burns i also had a dream today showing that christians have the righteous vision for luna classic and the art to protect it i believe this may come into place later as if we make good profits on the bull run and exit when we buy back into luna classic near bitcoin to zero christians can get a lot of luna classic and have more governance power over the chain such as running our own validators etc this will give us the ability to protect luna classic from bad changes and have the voting power to drive positive change for luna classic that is something to think about later i have also heard in a dream a while back that i believe was from the lord i heard an enemy of god saying we hate luna classic 
It's the enemy's money. Their enemy is us, Christians. I believe Luna Classic will be important for God's people. Please seek the Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you, Christopher. So as you guys can see right there, he had another dream basically connecting to his first dream regarding the Binance plan with Luna Classic, right? So just be on the lookout regarding Binance. Um, if there's any update, right, where they have a plan, where they have a new plan for Luna Classic. I think the best way to do this is follow Binance on Twitter, also CZ, because most likely as soon as that gets tweeted out or gets put up an article, Luna Classic will probably have a huge move. And I really like the fact that he stated that once Bitcoin does flash crash and Christians are able to buy more Luna Classic and own most of it and have our own validators which would then mean that christians have most of the voting power which means that most of the proposals will be voted and good right from christians that have most of the luna classic and voting power which is really good which he also says there that he heard an enemy of god saying we hate luna classic right so yeah guys just be on the lookout also for bitcoin as well if it starts to pump even more maybe to 30k 40k right just be on the lookout do not miss on taking profits right obviously not financial advice and i'll keep you guys updated as soon as we get more movements or anything regarding prophecy and luna classic and as well as shib right shib and shibarium so definitely put the notification bell so you guys can be up to date and i just want to say thank you guys so much don't forget to join the telegram which is public again god bless all of you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one peace